Hi, Matt from Invarian here, and welcome to the tutorial video on using the different print options in RapidPlan. In RapidPlan, there are various ways in which you can print your plan. I'll demonstrate a couple of these now. As you can see, I've got a finished plan in front of me, ready for printing. Once you're ready to print your plan, you can come up to File, Print, and you'll notice that you've got a few options here. Print Active Plan will just print it as the plan is, and you can specify a printer and press print. Um, if you want to customize all your borders and printing area, come to Print and to Print Options, and this will bring up another dialog box with a few different settings we can customize. So the page size will be set as standardized, and you can set your uh, print area or uh, page size here. So this will be specified when you originally uh, begun your plan, but you can set it again here for printing. So you can go through and select uh, the correct option for your plan. Um, as you'll notice, it'll have virtually every setting uh, that you require for printing onto um, various different sizes of paper. Uh, you can set your orientation here. Um, this will be automatically set to auto, um, just based on the orientation that you set at the start of your plan. Uh, you can set to portrait, but it obviously won't be displayed correctly, as you stated at the start of your um, plan settings. Um, so we recommend keeping it at auto for the best display. In this area here you can edit your margins. Um, so you can adjust these on the fly and that will automatically update on your page preview. Um, you can also turn off the page border by checking or unchecking this checkbox here. And then you can adjust its width um, if you're wanting a more dense and thicker border. Uh, you can adjust your print scaling here, so if you're wanting to fit it to page, you can have it set like it is now. Um, you can have it displayed differently if needed, or if you wanted it to a fixed print scale, um, you can specify that uh, in this fixed print scale drop-down box here. Uh, you can also adjust the alignment as well. Um, this will depend on how uh, dense the plan is, whether it's only taking up a portion of the page size, you can position it so it is center. Um, we've got multi-page print settings as well. Um, so if you're wanting the plan to display over multiple pages, you can click this box here um, and specify um, how many pages you want it to go across and also you can specify the overlap. So you can go through the different pages here and you can see the join lines for each of the pages. So if you're wanting to join all the pages together um, to display as one big area, um, you can print them off separately as seen here. Uh, we have some print frame settings options here. Um, so print frames are covered in a separate video. Um, I'll link this in the description below. Same with the watermark as well. Um, we do have a separate video that covers this feature. I'll also link this video in the description below. Um, so when you're ready to print your plan from here, once it's all set in your print options, uh, you can hit save um, and that'll be ready to print when you go to click on print active plan um, or when you click print in the print options menu here. Uh, so the next option we have for printing is the batch print option. Um, so I'll come over to another plan that I already have made up. Uh, and as you can see, this plan works across uh, two different print regions. So um, when we go into batch print, I'll show you how we can actually print those two print regions um, in the one go. So once you come up to file print, you can click on to batch print. Uh, and it'll bring up a little dialog box here. You'll just need to add in the plan that you're wishing to print. Um, so for this one, I want TCP3434. So you just select that. Uh, it'll bring up the plan here, um, but you'll see a little dialog box um, pop up in the corner. So this is just specifying uh, which area you want to print. If I click that, um, it'll change to print all print regions. If I click it again, it will allow me to specify and unclick or uh, check 
the specific print regions we want to print, but also the order in which they print as well. So as I've got it across two print regions here, I'd want my first print, my main print region to display first, and then the print region two to display second. So if you're wanting to uh, print those both at the same time, uh, you just need to check both, um, or you could just have all print regions checked. And then you come down to the print menu and it will print it as um, you've set out in your batch print settings. Uh, while you're working on your plan as well, um, there is a button in the bottom right hand corner here, um, which is what we call the in place print preview. Uh, this allows you to display how the plan will print um, on your plan without having to go to the print preview. So if you double click on this icon here, uh, it'll give you a view of how your border and plan will display when printed. That sums up the printing options for RapidPlan. Thanks for watching. Please hit subscribe below to be updated on new content at Inverium.